my name is Tyler Williamson. I'm a mass media arts major with a concentration in radio, TV, and film. And I'm a third year student here at Clark Atlanta University. I am so grateful that I have been selected for the NBCU scholarship. And this documentary is about HBCUs, the rise and fall, and everything under the sun, and what you should know here about Clark Atlanta University. So thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoy it. Bye. How you doing, Mr. Wells? What's going on? How you doing? I'm good. Thank you for being here today. Can you just tell me a little bit about yourself and why did you choose Clark Atlanta University? Okay, well, first of all, I am Larry Wells Jr. I'm a graduating senior, uh -huh. master of arts major with a concentration in radio, television, and film. And yeah, I chose Clark simply because, look, come right here, come right here. Okay, come right, okay. Right. Let look me, right here. Look right here. Hold on, let me get back on that. Let me get back on that. I see, that's you. That's me right there. You that's I mean? you. The reason why I chose Clark is because I knew the impact I would make would be forever lasting. So, considering that your parents went to Clark and Morehouse, do you think that, like, how do you rate your Clark Atlanta University experience? Is it everything you hoped it would be? Uh... I think that I would rate Clark like on a scale from one to ten. Like yeah, one to ten. At eight. At eight. Um, I feel like I have. The, I love my school. I have the best experience here. Ever. Okay. Like, I adore Clark. There are a lot of areas for improvement. Uh huh. But um, no, I love my school, and I feel like the lessons I've learned here is like it's gonna. I'm gonna take them with me wherever I go. Uh huh. Um, the only thing I can say. Oh, wait, this is where um, <laughs> my parents took a picture. Okay, so your they, parents took a picture right here. Yes, they did, and it was so cute. And now, like, I'm looking for my AUC love story. And okay, so you believe in the whole HBCU love, the whole yeah, college no, sweetheart I thing. I believe in it still. Like, I'm I'm a hopeful romantic, not a hopeless List romantic. romantic. Okay, that's always good yeah. to, like, say. <laughs> but, like, yeah, I say an eight. A eight. And then and this is just, I think it's just because you have this, like, love for, like, the history, like, you know, you were born into it. Yeah. So, like, where do you, like, what are the pros and cons? Where do, where do you, what would you tell someone who's a senior who's thinking about this HBCU, like, PAV? Well, okay, like I said before, I feel like Clark does really well in film and media. So I feel like if you're into that kind of thing, like, that Clark is especially for you. Um know what else to say a con yeah and be like so honest okay the safety department could be better could be i feel like they have rules that they don't abide by but i feel like we're in the pro like i feel like due to recent events we're in the process of trying to mend that back together like actually trying this time hi i'm mars and i'm from oakland california i'm a first semester senior majoring in theater and communication studies with a concentration in film i chose clark Atlanta university because of my career everyone thinks if you want to be an actress and you should take your talents to hollywood but here in atlanta black actors and actresses are thriving so i felt like being here at clark learning from some of the best professors in the acting field was the best choice for me Thank you. I don't know this girl, but I'm digging out her ways. She five two and I'm six four and I'm going in them chains. is what you make it so I feel like every university every college every HBCU PWI all of that has problems and some stuff don't get out in the air like most schools so of course it's stuff everything's not going to go right um and it also what you make it so being in different organizations you know creating those bonds helps your college experience too to learn from different other people and network different stuff like this like I was a cabbie. Yeah, which means campus activity board. It means we plan the stuff for the school. We get the school going. We make get it the lit. school going. What did we just have? I think it was Spring Fest. Yes, and guess what we had? Two CMU artists. Like, yeah. And many bagels at our studio. Watch, I'm like, come on, let's be so real. 
So it turns out this wasn't about the rise and falls of HBCUs, but it was about CAU and just how much it means to us. So we hope you enjoyed it as much as we did making it for you.